Hi, my name's Carrie, and I'm an intern at the Catskill Center working on a project called CRISP, the Catskill Regional Invasive Species Partnership. I'm here today to talk to you about one of our top 10 invasive species in the Catskills, giant hogweed. Giant hogweed was introduced into the U.S. in 1917, and it was used as an ornamental plant for its giant white flowers that look similar to Queen Anne's leaves. Giant hogweed grows in many disturbed areas, such as along roadsides and riverbanks. It favors more soils and partial shade. It causes severe burns that will recur for many years. Giant hogweed has three common lookalikes. The first one is cow parson. While giant hogweed has dome-shaped flowers with between 50 and 100 rays, cow parsnip has flatter flowers with fewer rays. The leaves of cow parsnip have shallower lobes and are not as serrated. The second common lookalike is Angelica. Angelica's flowers are softball size and shape. It can also be distinguished from giant hogweed by its smooth stem and compound leaves. The third lookalike is Poison Hemlock. This plant grows between 4 and 9 feet tall, while giant hogweed grows up to 15 feet. Also, the flowers of Poison Hemlock are less dense and their leaves are compound serrated, appearing much smaller and narrower than giant hogweed. What you are now observing is an employee from Chris controlling a site of giant hogweed. Since this plant is so dangerous, we recommend you contact the DEC or Chris for more information and they'll come out to your property and identify the plant and decide further action from there. Remember, do not touch giant hogweed as its sap will cause burns.